when you tell people you live in Eden more, what do they say? They say, I'm so sorry. It's sloughing off, and when I talk about sloughing off, it's actually the sides of this become unstable, and they fall actually into and down. It makes me nervous, because she likes to come outside and play and run around, and I'm worried that she's going to fall into a hole. <laughs> You have five children, and you live across the street from, I think, a 20-foot pit. Yeah, we do not let them go over there. They have to stay in our yard, but even the yards have drop spots within it. We have below me a, an example of a failure over a, a pipe. This is actually the backside of that, what I pretty much called a, a trench failure. Um, it looks like that it was not adequately compacted. What's the big priority for you? For me, the streets and the erosion. Just because I have kids, I want to make sure that they're safe. I really don't care about the amenities or anything or the look. We, everybody who's bought in here, our uh, expectations have dropped. We don't care. We just want it to be safe now. My parents and everybody have been told that something was going to be done for year, two years now and nothing has, so I'm hoping that something gets done now. We're hesitant. I mean, we are excited, but just with all the history we've had, I think we're all just hesitant and waiting to actually see some, something done. We closed on a Friday afternoon with this company, and they were here on Monday morning with bulldozers, cleaning, and repairing. All of the neighbors were calling each other, do you see that, do you see that? I'm blown away at how many construction vehicles I'm counting or seeing coming in. They made this a priority and, and it was taken care of basically the first two days of construction. It is safe and stable and once we get permanent vegetation we will be able to build, build houses on the site. I think when we see the streets done, that's going to be huge for all of us to not have to weave through our, our neighborhood. We have filled the areas that had sinkholes. We're making the roads passable. We've been very pleased with the progress and, and we're really looking forward to seeing what the next six months or year have, has in store for us. They have done exactly what they said they were going to do. Exactly, which is totally not how it happens in today's world. But they said we would come in, we would do this, this, and this. They came in and they did number one, number two, number three. Over the next two to three months, I think you're gonna see a total change in, in this community. And, and we're glad we're a part of it.